Welcome back, heroes. Future Jorky here, inserting myself once again before we set up this episode. Um, I just wanted to say thank you to all of our subscribers. Uh, we've grown exponentially here in the last couple of days, which is awesome. Um, we're very happy you guys like our content enough to actually subscribe to our channel. <laughs> Um, as some of you may know, we've currently got three series going on right now. Um, we of course got this one, the Sky Factory 4 series, but we also have Heroes, a single player series, uh, going where you're playing a game called RimWorld. Um, if you don't know what RimWorld is, it's kind of like a, an awesome storyteller sci-fi game that honestly you shouldn't be missing. Um, I myself am playing a game called Stardew Valley, which if you don't know what that is, it's a, uh, kind of like a role-playing farming simulator game. That I promise, if you watch just some of the episodes, you'll be hooked. <laughs> so, um, yeah, after you're done watching this episode, go check out those other two series as well. We also tried our hand at it streaming here on YouTube the other day. Um, I was playing a game called Gloomhaven, which is not usually a game you'd probably see us, us create a Let's Play on, but I thought it would actually be fun to stream it as I played to talk and interact with you guys on over on Discord and even in the, uh, the, the stream chat. <laughs> That was, uh, that was a lot of fun. I think probably played almost over three hours of that game. So a lot of fun there. Um, I definitely plan on doing more streams. Probably every Wednesday night, I'll probably plug in a new, uh, a new game to play and stream and chat with you guys. So if you guys have any suggestions that you'd like uh, one of us to stream, pop over into our Discord chat and let us know. Um, I have all the links for that in our description down below. So um, <laughs> anyway... Plug over, I promise. <laughs> so, without further ado, let's start up the episode. All right, welcome back. We are getting food. I made apple sandwiches. Over here, in the sandwich station. We're just lacking bread, which is what Jared and I are about to do here in a second. We're going to get our wheat situation okay. sorted out. Whoa. Okay. You ready? You're, you're getting disordered. Yeah, but your head was on backwards when you were running. That was really weird. <laughs> well, uh, I'm magic, my friend. Clearly. Yep, some of that Paige's black magic wore off on me. Yeah, you know. <laughs> so, I was editing episode one, uh, and you say black magic a lot. Yes, yeah, black magic. <laughs> it was. It's insane. Yes. I think I counted, like, I stopped counting it, like, 50. You should just put a ticker in the top of the screen, man. I mean, I might. I might just do that. Yeah. Was I was starting to get worried. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. You were uh, very concerned thing. with Paige's activities. <laughs> dude, <laughs> dude, that pig sound had me going, man. Like, it's been a very long time since I've gotten got on an April Fool's, and I was <laughs> I was totally entrenched in that one. Dude, I'm still getting got right now. Like, it's still honking at yeah, me. Yeah, you're right. It is. I, I literally just started realizing it again. I think I learned how to tune it out. <laughs> really? Yeah. I have not. Every time you bring it up, no. I hear it. You'll have to teach me that secret. Good lord. It's called you selective hearing. Jared was oh. honking back at it. Oh, hi, baby. Hey, do you want to come show them the automated system down here for emeralds and diamonds? Oh, yes, because you need to explain that one. Okay. So basically what we've set up is we needed power. So we figured out that we can get these generators right here mm -hmm. to power this battery, which then will go into these energy and transformers. This generator burns like everything, right? Anything that's burnable, yes. it'll make power Wood, out of? sticks, any of it, which I'll throw some sticks in there right now and it'll get going. Oh, boom. Um, look at that. It's almost, it's, it's almost free. If you look in this one right here, you're going to see all these little GPS markers. Mm-hmm. And each one of those is to a different locati location on the map. Right. And so if we was to click on, say, like this chest, if this was something that needed power, we just right click it. We come over here into one of the empty slots, we'd insert it, and then we click the little uh, question mark and it'd actually detect it and it'd start sending power. Ooh, very nice, very Which nice. Which is what we've done over here. This is our automated uh, our latex, latex processing slide. unit rubber all of it mm -hmm. which i do need to upgrade this water fluid extractor good. and the block placer there yeah yeah water. these infinite water i think you can upgrade them and i think it outputs more stuff yeah we needed copper though but now we have copper so that's on my list of things to do today okay let's go down here 
The, these and are twigs are, moved, are lovely, by the way. We moved our bonsais around now, so we actually yes. have little bonsai nooks. A little hidden away, little yeah. buttes. We have plans for this stuff soon. Yep. And over here, we by have we, all I mean, of our little Georgia's minerals. Gonna do it. Uh, so right here is our diamonds and our emeralds. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So let's go downstairs, and I'll show you what we're doing with those. Yes, ma'am. Oh my goodness. I'm just gonna so, put this out there. Our base has been getting pretty big. This is our item mover. I don't actually know if I can. Item I cables. think it's working. I think it's working. Mm -hmm. Hang on. And I'm assuming this item transfer node works the same thing as the energy transfer node. Yeah. You got the GPS marker transports it from where you're putting it to where you want it. Yeah, it kind of fell off the map. Oh, well, fly like <laughs> fly like an eagle, young lady. Also, okay. I'm a little jealous of these slime boots you guys have. I, I, I need me a pair. <laughs> okay, but anyway, so I've I've set it up with the GPS markers, like you said, from there to go right here right. to these two different crafting tables. Mm -hmm. One's for diamonds and one's for emeralds, which... Crafting up the old emeralds? The emeralds are getting sucked into this yeah, one. Yeah, it okay. looks like it's backwards. Yeah. yeah the diamonds are going know. in this one, the emeralds but are going in that one. I gotta fix it. It's a thing. I need a bigger inventory. Uh, Yeah. Um, backpacks would be nice. I would have filled like 20 backpacks by now. Yeah. You know. So what do you got going on right now, Paige? I'm still trying to figure this out to try to fix this. I also need to stop the vines from growing infinitely. And then I also need to, um, upgrade that water tank. So I'll probably do those next. All right, here I made a couple of wrenches. Oh, I need bronze, not copper. How do I get bronze? See if we can fix those tubes up. I might break it, but, you know, I'm just going to go willy-nilly on it. That's okay. Huh. It doesn't seem like it's doing anything. Here. Are you sure this is the right tool? Mm -hmm. No, it's a cyclic wrench. I mean, I can I can give a what is it? Uh, the crescent hammer a shot. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. Hmm. That's I need odd. to figure out a way to filter out all this wood and send all this wood over there. Well, to that did thing. you you have those nodes like? They're tied to that crafting grid, right? Yeah. No, 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 that's not what I'm talking about. My, I have the wood already out of those. I'm talking about the wood needs to be transferred from each of these cabinets to the um, the furnace over there to be burnt into materials. So whenever items get taken out of these cabinets, the cabinets don't leave an item left, right? So it just it empties the cabinet, so whenever you go back into these diamond cabinets, go ahead and look inside. You have a ton of wood and sticks and leaves building up. Right. Right? So I need a way to empty all that out, because if my acorns keep coming out of this like they are... Yeah, it's going to fill up with wood uh, and sticks. It just leaves more room for all that. Yeah, I think that's yeah. what... So we need to figure out a way to... I think that's what that. Jared has started down here with the transfer pipes. If you set up a, a system like this, you can have this uh, one in between chest. Yeah, I think we can figure it out that way. With each cabinet being uh, pulled out with the item transfer nodes. And what they'll do is they'll go into a buffer chest and that buffer chest will separate, well, we'll have filters on it. And each of those filters will move items from there to the crafters um especially if these things are going to be finicky like this i mean the only thing i can assume with this diamond and emerald issue we have is that you have the wrong thing oh wait no you fixed it but you're still getting diamond egg corns and the emeralds but yeah basically if you want to do it wirelessly you're gonna to have to um connect more stuff up via that node 
and those nodes will have to transport transport everything. So what you're going to want is a central area to have sticks, woods, and leaves, um, and then that chest be be transported by the wireless uh, to the generator. If that makes sense. Elsewise, you're going to have to pull out from each one of them wirelessly, so you'll need that many connectors. Whereas if you do it with the centralized chest or storage device, you can just transport it all from there. Oh boy. But I think I'm going to start the uh -oh. um, pulverizer. All right, are you back, buddy? Yeah. Yep, I got your well, crescent hammer. Happy birthday. Who's fallen from the sky? I have one. Who's fallen from the sky? Page fell. Once. But that was it. No. Oh. Strange. Yep, strange occurrences. I mean, it's pretty, pretty, okay. you know, pretty standard for us. Um, we were, Paige and I were just discussing, um, no, the hammer's for you, buddy. The crescent hammer. I have one. Oh, you do? Okay. Well, 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 thank you, though. You like Donation to the random number right? god. <laughs> there you go. What was that, Paige? Do you like orange? Like the color orange or oranges? Yes, uh, yes on both counts. Orange. Why? Okay. Mm, okay, hold on. I mean, my favorite color is green, but. Okay, well, he orange. has the green boots, so unless you can pry him off his feet. I mean, I could kill it off his feet. <laughs> well, I'm not in any part of that, so. Uh, I think you instigated it. I think Jared can agree with that. No. Uh huh. Not at all. What? What's happening? What did you? Paige, Paige said I can you have the green boots if I could if, if I could kill you and take the boots. Um, that's exactly what she said, by the way. No, that is not what I that's said. Yeah, that, yeah, this, yes, it is. No. Mm hmm. It's pretty. Savage. Oh, we have the right click. Beautiful. Where are you at? Uh, collecting bread so I can make another sandwich. <laughs> what up? There you go. Hey, hey, got boots. Got the bouncy boots. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and make, start making the pulverizer, Jared. Does that sound like a good deal for you? Are you gonna be able to make the mob farm today? Uh, we were planning on it. We need to get vector plates together, which means we need more slime. Okay, um, well we have rice. plenty of slime. We have plenty of sugar for for it. We have slime over here. Okay. In here. Okay, I got you. There's two trees. Boom shakalaka. Here you go. You can have you can have this one. Yes. Thanks. Get With that all junk. All that build. junk. All that junk up in your trunk. Saying I got a big butt. You're making it weird now. No, I'm I'm just saying you have all that junk in your inventory. Making it weird now. <laughs> <Psh>. <laughs> I have Are a basic toy tank if we need it. I'm about to freaking use this building gadget. <laughs> damn it. You're welcome. Asshole. Um, is this the spot you were wanting to build out, right? No, I'm it's over here. I'm about to do it right now, yes. Okay. Over here. Did you fix the farm area? I'm about to. Wait, are we Why putting the mob farm over here? Mob farm is going to be in the center of the whole island. Oh, Okay. Yeah, that's a, probably right. one of the better places to uh, yeah to keep everything centralized. Are we, how are we going to do that with um, the mob drops? Um, probably are we going to put them to a different area? Uh, yes. Okay, three stacks of vector plates, done and dusted. So we got that. That's a lot. Yeah, I, well, I mean, I just shift clicked it and uh, it just happened that way. Verizon. Hold on. I am trying to do this thing real fast. Is that right? Are you, uh, you're rocking that building gadget, aren't you? Right? Yeah, but I'm looking at the uh, blueprint right now. Mm. And I'm trying to gauge it appropriately. Actually, can I mirror it? I can't. Go. Okay. 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 Yeah, I think I I did. Okay. Go. Do we want to do the planter harvester setup first before we do the pulverizer? I don't care. 
Oh no, I ran out of. Oh no, I ran out of uh, fence posts. <laughs> okay. Uh, how are we looking on Emeralds, Paige? Um, I don't know. You can go down and check. I'm sure we have a bunch. Because we can jump straight to the plus 12 range here if we got the emeralds for it. I mean, if you want to also throw in the uh, plastic into the furnace while you're over there. Uh, yeah, I, I can do that. Yep. You want the orange ones? Yeah, I like orange. They'll go better with your outfit, dude. They'll match That's your right. cheeks. <laughs> My fins. Hey. I mean, are they fins? I don't know. Looks a lot like a cheek, you know? That little tail on the back. <laughs> you mean the weird shaped penis? <laughs> <laughs> well, we weren't going to say anything, but you know, yeah. it's supposed to be a tail. I promise. <laughs> I had to. Oh my goodness! All right. All right um. So yes. Uh, upgrade. I'm going to upgrade that uh, the planter and that harvester over there. I need I five stacks. Of dirt. Hey. Uh, there's some dirt in a random dump chest over there. We'll mm -hmm. just call them the paint. Haley chest. My head. My head. I did. Head. I seen it, and uh, yeah. you know it. Um, it's so cute. It increases your intimidation value for sure. Yeah. It's my friend. All right, so we effectively have five uh, five um, piles of diamonds, stacks of diamonds, whatever. Nice. Yeah, it's like, yeah. come here for a second. Uh, a moment, please. Oh, we had a glass, really? Uh, there there's some glass in the chest. Yep, I snagged some. One moment, Jared, right. I'm coming. Where you at? I'm over in the area. Oh, the, the corner area? Mm -hmm. I'm a coming. I'm a coming. All right, well, sit right there and watch. Ready? <laughs> oh god, that's so satisfying. I love that thing so much. Isn't that there is one that favorite. like d deletes stuff? Yeah. Like you, there's one that does one mining for you. Yeah. Excavating. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, man. Ah, so satisfying. I love it so much. I know it's my favorite. I'm a little jealous. Thing. That you didn't make me one, you know? Well, there it's <laughs> like the most expensive thing is a diamond. Oh. And the oh, time. Yeah, I, I just seemed to be pretty easy. I was going to mess with it whenever I, we started the uh, mob farm. Oh, yeah, you'll want it for the mob farm for sure. Yes, sir. Yeah. So, oh, dang. Dude, this one plant gatherer can cover this entire island. With that oh, plus really? 12 range upgrade. Yeah. That's nice. Yeah, it is. So, that made some of handy. Yeah, we need we need a planter. What? What? So a plant fine. fertilizer. What? Plant sower. That's what we need. So we want a sower and a fertilizer, I'm assuming, to maximize. So let's Come on, guys. Hit an A and an A. Get it over there on our... Come on. Follow me. I have weed in my hand. You should love it. So let's get to work. Boom. Hey, there we go. Is now? We got the fertilizer. And boom. Look at that. Ladies and gentlemen. We're okay, rocking. We're I'm cooking with oil. Right here. Back. We got our plant sower facing up. Place that away. Place that away. Let's make another upgrade for the other one. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Ugh. We're gonna have food for days, bread forever to make sandwiches. Oh man. Right, plant gatherer. I'm assuming if we push out sludge, which we're gonna have to get rid of. Uh, fertilizer, I'm not sure what we need to put into you. I'm sure it's some sort of fertilizer. Here we go, fertilizer. Sewage composter. And I'm assuming that's what we need to get rid of the sludge. So let's go ahead and put an A on that. Get it up over here so we can do some buildy builds here in a moment. Search through pages type of inventory. And a boom. And oh my gosh, it's magic. You know. Wait, how'd you get it? 
we don't have we don't have free range cattle here. What, what is happening? Um, and if I do remember correctly, this bad boy damages you if you're close to it. So we're gonna have to stick this downstairs somewhere. Watching everybody be AFK, ditching me alone to do all the hard work. Bunch of slackers. I feel like we should mess with Paige. Yes, we're gonna put her in a glass cage. And that, my friends, that is, uh, this specimen here is what we call a Siamese twin. You see, because there's two of them attached, but at the head, not at the hip. It's, uh, it's truly an exotic find. Um, it's not many of these in the wild. They're called the page. And what they do is they spend the primarity of their time standing here doing nothing. Now, you will find another specimen that lives on this server. Um, and it's the elusive uh, Jorgi411. So you gotta sneak up on this one, because he's a crafty boy. And he also stands around, staring off into the distance, doing nothing. But you don't, you don't cage him, because he gets feisty. And he'll come back at you and do really mean things like kill you. He's very, very mean. He's a predator. You gotta be wary of him. Also, if you pay attention closely to his uh, model, he has black lines down his, his arms. I'm not sure what that is. I think it's some sort of camouflage defensive mechanism. I'm not entirely sure. But uh, further science is needed. Can't complain about the slackers if you're going to be a slacker. Let's go back to work. All right, come on now. Right, get some munchies. I don't want to get in there. Nom, 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 nom. And I'm assuming this is going to make stuff, like maybe like dirt and whatnot. Um, you can actually look that up. Um, when provided with power and two buckets of sewage, it will solidify into fertilizer. Okay, so this is the, yeah, okay, so this is how we get fertilizer. It, it just produces the fertilizer out of sewage, and it's going to fertilize the ground for us even better, so it's going to make everything quicker. Um, hopefully we don't get overloaded on all the plants and whatnot that we need, but I think it'll be really good for us. It'll make us bread really, really quick, and probably infinitely, so. Okay, um, we have our rage add-on right so let's let's uh, go ahead and click these on see our working areas make sure we're getting full coverage um and it looks like we're we're over we're overshooting uh both the width and the length which is good i mean it's a little bit of a waste but you know it's covering everything we need and that's all that really matters um so the next step is going to be getting this place hoed And Paige yes. is back with us. And you have, did you get, you got, we got power set up to the planter, right? Yep, power set up to the planter. Oh, beautiful. You are an angel, a legend, <laughs> a scholar. Uh, well, it's saying we don't have any power in the planter or plant sower, Paige. All right, let me look. The cool thing about the plant sower is each one of these colored. Oh. Uh, sections here, Paige and everyone, is a quadrant on the sewing field. So if I put it in there, it's going to do that, the set of uh, red square, right? So if you look at down here, How you'll see red. So it's in the top left. So that portion will get planted wheat seeds, that 16 portion. Hey, how many sowers do you have? Just the one. Okay, that's why. I didn't know so, about that one. Yep. So each one of these can be different plants. So later on, if we want to do like beetroot or potatoes or whatnot, um, you can do it that way and have a have an individualized for you. We're going to detect target block and now it has power. Ooh, let's see this thing go off. It should just start spitting seeds into the hoed ground. That's not. Maybe there's something no. we gotta do. Um, always active. Nope, oh, there, there we go. Yep. See? Yeah, yep. look at it now. Like I said, the right will start planting up here. Boom, look at that. And it'll start drawing seeds out of each quadrant that it goes through. Oh, and then you can push lock inventory, so it'll always plant those uh, areas there. Uh, it'll keep uh, ghost seeds. See right there? So when you load into it um, from the, uh, not the fertilizer, not the gatherer. Yes, the gatherer, sorry. 
the gatherer will have an inventory here full of seeds and wheat, and then uh, fluid sludge as well. So, oh, Jared and the fam are making a little fire pit. Aww. <laughs> Okay, so let's do this right. Let's get our output output chest on the uh, on the actual harvester here. So there we go. Paige, Paige. Yeah. Um, why aren't you around to uh, ensure and, that I'm doing things right? Um, again, again and ignored, and that should. Yep, there we go. Starting to pull it out. Put it in the chest. Boom. Um, and then we need to get the seeds from the chest here and get it back into the planter. Paige, this is a way we can do that wirelessly. Okay, well, so I, I mean, I've been working really hard. I, my, do, I, do I smell like a full-on manimal? I got a manimal I mean, sting. I, I try to stay across the base from you and just try to stay upwind, you know? Mm, uh, well, <laughs> I, I got this new man musk deodorant. Yeah, I, I return it. Ah, just return it. Okay. Um, I did, I did go hunting last week, so I, it's, it's hard getting all that hunter smell, you know, off you, cause you gotta, you know, blend in with the environment, you know? Well, you're not blending. No. You're overcoming the environment. But I was in the rain for like three days. Did you ever wonder why if you look up you'd see sky and no rain? It's kind of weird, isn't it? No. Okay. What did you need to move? Did you want to move seeds? Yes. And we're going to go right here into this item extraction. Mm-hmm. We're going to put a seed in there. We're going to have a filter. And we're going to whitelist it only. Right. Because whitelist is uh, something you want to pull out. Blacklist yep. is something you don't. And if you look inside of this. Yep. This is the, the right cue that it wants to send, right? So we need that little baton thing, right? Uh-huh. But if you see on the right side that little inventory hole where yep. the seeds are. Yep. That's the cue. That's showing what we're doing. So we now have our GPS marker. Uh -huh. I'm gonna come over here and we're gonna right click it. Okay, so all I gotta do is just like uh, shift right click or something like that. Yep, and then we're gonna come back in here. And stick it in the slot. It, detect it, done. Paige, I don't know, have I ever told you that you're the wind beneath my wings, you know? <laughs> I mean, you're welcome. I mean, I mean, don't get fooled and, yourself, but you know. You know the best part? We don't have any pipes that are moving stuff, so it's going to hopefully not bog down the server. You know, it's almost like a field of dreams. Look at it. It's beautiful. It's just absolutely beautiful. Oh, oh, oh. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, oh. Pro gamer. Can you do me a favor? Um, can I do your favor after my spoonful of peanut butter? We won't. You're eating peanut butter with a spoon. Yeah, crunchy peanut butter with a spoon. It's normal. That's normal people do that. I like how you have to normalize it. <laughs> I'm not insecure like about normal. my peanut butter obsession, okay? I'm not insecure that. about it at all. No, not at all. How dare you judge me for my eating habits, Miss? I'm gonna eat chips 24/7 all day, every day. Okay, okay. you know it's a thing. <laughs> More of an obsession, but yes. Okay, you know. Crinkle, crinkle, chomp, chomp. <laughs> I keep the mic. Uh, that's all I could do. So really, I wouldn't even need these cupboards. Right. You want to help me do something really quick and try something? Jared had plans for it. Um, because yeah, we're going to use the byproduct to power the base. Yeah, but if I could at least do this for the emeralds and diamonds, we could be working on that. Yeah, but I gotta make the wild farm. Okay. Jeez! That would be awesome. Hey, man. do you like my furnace generator that I made? Jared was yeah. trying to figure out this kind of generator over here, and I came out with this little crystal generator, and he's like, What is that? I was oh, like, yeah, he's trying to make a uh, magmatic germ. Yeah, generator. and it didn't work. So then I made this, and he's like, I hate you. <laughs> and it's powering quite a bit of stuff right now, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that generator right there. 
produces like the amount of like three or four like beginning generators like you know yeah cold generators or wood generators that's like it's worth like four or five of them it's ridiculous did i not make the right thing uh that looks like the metallurgic infuser right there and this looks like the manufacturing yeah but i feel like that's not what i needed what, what are you what are you trying to do I'm trying to make steel. Okay, so you want to put the coal in the purple, and you see that bar on the left where it says carbon? That is what it infuses into the iron that you need to put in the red side. Oh, okay, mm -hmm. so... So you got to okay. put more than just one or two pieces of coal. You need, like, ten. Okay, I was thinking that I was actually making crushed coal and crushed iron, and I was going to smelt that together to make steel. Mm -mm. But that works mm -mm. even yeah, better. Yeah, the medical infuser is better, better, because... You can just put an uh, iron ingot in there. There we go. See, there you go. And then it'll make yeah. a steel. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I would just make a couple of coal blocks, like 10 or so, oh, and then put a stack of coal iron coal. in there. Oh. Dude, we have steel. Beautiful. This is awesome. Oh, I thought you could die him. Here you go. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, whenever you go into your bag, you open up your bag, and on the left side you can click what color you want it. Oh, is that how it worked? That's yeah. right. Okay. I th yeah, there you go. I remember now. You're a smart girl. Yeah. Now I can Why do this. I have saplings in my inventory? I don't know. I didn't do it. I can promise you okay. that. Okay. Yeah, I'm sure. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, what else do we need to suck up? We got dark oak, don't we? <laughs> Alright, so let's get this base down so we can see what we're looking at here. Okay, so I need steel to make something else.
What did you do, Paige? How dare you do it? Pedro! I'm already mad because you're not telling me what it is. Arg. Sithyar is a sea. That is a great joke. I don't care what anyone has to say. <laughs> I laugh at it all the time. What the f- mm. Wait. <laughs> Wait. Who cares? How is- uh -oh. How is dark oak the same oh, thing oh. as oak? Oh, that sucks. Really? Really, game. Really. Is that really? Really? Okay. Okay. You know what? You good? I'm glad we got that on camera. Hmm? I'm glad we got it on camera. It was oak. I was using oak, Paige. I was using oak, oak, oak wood as scaffolding. Yeah. Yeah, and I vein mined the oak wood because it's not the same thing as dark oak wood. And it vein mined that. Erg. Yeah. Erg, erg, erg. Alright, well. Anyways, well, since I deleted all the progress I was, <laughs> I was gonna do to finish the episode, <laughs> I guess we can call it there. Got enough done today. You know, it's, uh, it's great. You know, just, just, just peachy. Yeah. You know? Yeah. So, yes. We'll call it there on my vein mining kerfluffle. Um, apparently... Or excavator doesn't know how to tell the difference between dark oak and regular oak. Um, and uh, and uh, Paige help us slim through this episode. You know, um, the double page, the one with the one on their head. Oh hey, we could use nickel saplings to create biofuel. And she's she's still on about progressing. I, um, what did I need about? Oh. True legend. <gasps> oh my gosh, are you excited? Thank you very much I just for watching. Clapped.